Welcome to Stephen Nonsense. Today we'll be going to do a tutorial on how to fast forward using YouTube Editor. A lot of people say it can't be done but it actually can be done and I'm going to show you. This is the video I want to fast forward. So it starts off. Kind of version two. I need two for the fairy gardens that I've made. So I'm just this is the clip that I want to fast forward the so this is the part that I want to speed up obviously it's not sped up yet <laughs> I'm just showing you the before and then I'll show you the after so I probably want to speed up round about a, what what was that 29 seconds or 30 seconds like just after I say and this is a sped up version to about This is still the slow, the normal time, sorry. Still the normal time. Still the normal time. And then there the video is pretty much finished. And there, I probably want to stop it there. So, there's quite a big chunk that I want to fast forward and here is the actual finished video and this is the part that I actually fast forward I cut out about five minutes and this so is just to show you see goes. here goes and so yeah I managed to speed it up with music over the top, free music. And that goes all the way. Up to about about to stop see that's where I wanted it to stop so I was able to fast forward using the YouTube editor and that's what we'll go through next of how to do that so we want to create a video so we press create and video editor and as you probably already know this, I've, I've downloaded the introduction already. But what I did want to show you was I downloaded the first clip and then I wanted to show you what I did with the second clip that I'm actually going to fast forward halfway through. So here we go. So I'll do a sped up kind of version two. I need two things that I've made. So here now my second clip, so that was my intro and my second clip the whole of the clip because this is the clip that I want it's 11 minutes 57 it's too long um, and I actually wanted to show I've showed a slowed up version of how to make a gnome house and now I want to do a sped up version so halfway in this video well around about 20 seconds to 11.09 I want to go shlup, and I want to cut out seven minutes by fast forwarding that part it's a lot easier if you're fast forwarding the whole thing the whole clip but I'm not, I'm just fast forwarding a bit of it. So I've taken that whole clip, that 11.56 of how to make a, a gnome house, and I've put it in there here, how to make a gnome house. However, what I, what I have then done is I'll show you the part that I want to fast forward. Do a sped up kind of See, I'm going to do the sped up version. 
and the part that I'm just about to fast forward here I've cut out I've just cut it out I've cut out the whole thing yeah um, because that's the part that I want to fast forward and then what I've done is I've trimmed it up until the part where I want to stop fast forwarding so that's the end so I've got the beginning of the mint so I've put the whole clip in there and I've cut out the middle part that I want to fast that I want sped up which is here which is here now this is the whole video I am just going to trim it so we what we do is we go to enhancements this is how we fast forward it this is how we trim it and this is the whole video and I don't want the whole video I just want that part so we've decided that we're going to trim it and you work out exactly from the clip that you put in to exactly I can't remember exactly I think it was 19 seconds here goes so I will I'll clip it about I think it was 19 seconds so I will that's 15 whoops 18 oh 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 you have to be kept there so yeah did I clip that out yeah so I want it to start there and then I want it to end and I want to trim it at the end half as well I want it to be stop it there so press play and where will this go up to and we'll see what they look like when they come out of here so we've clipped it at the beginning I still need to clip it at the end so it's about 11 oh nine. let's see if that's right up to Oh, I want to go a bit more. That was too much. There. So, I've trimmed it. Done. Yeah. So, I've taken out two minutes. I've just, I've cropped it to when I've said I'm going to start the fast forward. And then it's gone to the end. Yeah to the very end now then what I will do now actually it's still a little bit I'm not too let me just I want it to go a little bit more now I'm happy because <laughs> it's fiddly it's fiddly so you crop you crop it to wherever you want it to be cropped And then, when you're happy, when you're happy with your video, then you can slow motion or the time lapse. This is slow motion is on the normal YouTube editor, but 
the time lapse the way to fast forward is only on the enhancements page and you can only get onto the enhancements page you can't get onto the enhancements page when you're doing this when you're doing this you cannot get onto the enhancements page you've literally got to get a single video and do the enhancements on just a single video so we want to what if we want to go four times as fast see what that looks like Oh, that's a bit too fast. Two times. And that's pretty good. So, it's fine, eh? That's my video. Now then. Then we just save it. That's all we do. It might take a while to save. That's okay. We're saving it. Okay? Now, what we do then is we put that saved video, when it's saved it'll come up here um, unless you want to put music with it if you want to put music with it like I did once, you, once you've saved it so you get your cropped video and you want music to it so you just press audio now I'm a huge fan of, these are all free, I'm a huge fan of classical music. I tend to pick Mozart or Beethoven or whatever. Um, where's Mr. Mozart? Where are you? Um, what's this one? And if you can't find it, just I couldn't that's oh dear <laughs> just tap in Mozart and they'll just find you yeah that's the one that's the one so yeah so it's got all sorts as I said it's got classical pop children's holiday and they're all free and I quite like this one it actually goes with the video too it kind of it's like in sync and so when we've done that then we go back to our video editor because remember we put the whole clip in here we trimmed it the clip and then we put me and then we fast forwarded it and then we put music on top of it and then we just put it into our Go back to video editor, I might have just... And then drag that clip into that space, in between the two clips. Like we had the whole clip, and then we drag it into the middle of the beginning and the end, this, this, the sliced version. You remember we put the whole clip into the video editor? And we chopped out the middle bit that we wanted, we chopped out the middle bit, and then we took the clip to enhancer, cropped the edges, the middle that bit that we wanted to fast forward, and then we put that back. It sounds, I'm making it sound way more complicated than it is. I mean, it is slightly complicated, but once you get your head around it, you realize that, oh, is that all? It can be done. You can fast forward using YouTube. It's just, it's a shame that the enhancer, the enhancer should be on here. Um, and it's not, that's what's the confusing thing. You have to take your single video and take it over to the enhancer, enhance it by fast forwarding it. And is this it? Here we go. Yeah, and we've put it in there. I'll just try and find you the exact, the exact place where I slipped here we go. Here it goes. So, and I'm fading it out. You can fade it out using these, which is quite cool. I slipped it in, so I had the beginning clip and the end clip, and I slipped in that, and so now it just it's seamlessly in there. I, I do like to use the fade in, <laughs> and uh, probably a bit naff to most, but I quite I think it's cleaner. And that's how you do it. That's how you use YouTube Editor to fast forward or to speed up 
your part a whole clip or part of a clip this was part of a clip and there we are with music to it but it's just this is a little bit fiddly you have to kind of clip and cut and trim and take it over to the enhancer because the enhancer isn't here it should be that's the only downside but hey it's free editing tool i think it's once you get used to it youtube edit it's pretty snazzy it's pretty good um and it trims it down i trimmed as i might have said seven minutes out of this video um and i think it looks really good so next time i'll be showing you how to upload this onto youtube taking half the time i actually condense it i use a program um to condense the video because sometimes it can take like up to an hour to download but i've you can cut out 80 percent of that if you condense it first and also if you condense the thumbnails it just is so much faster so that's what we'll be doing next hope you enjoyed this little tutorial on how to fast forward using youtube editor please feel free to ask any questions if you're not quite sure if i've gabbled on and not made myself clear which you know is Mm, pretty standard um but yeah i uh, hope you enjoyed and um thank you for joining us at stuff and nonsense and we'll see you next time bye